going on, my name is Chris, and welcome back to another exciting episode of Life is Strange. Now caught up to the journal. Hopefully, there won't be any more 20-minute episodes, at least sort till towards the end here. Because, good lord, it's taking forever. Let's uh, let's catch up on our photos here. We need a picture of this freaking bronze bird. Skellington. Oh, we missed this picture! <gasps> that was in freaking Victoria's room! Dang it! I'm an idiot! <sighs> Whatever. God dang it, I'm an idiot. Whoa! I broke everything. How does how do I get a picture of that? Chick, chick, chick. Brown talk. My only option is to talk to freaking Chloe Price. You think I care about you, Chloe? I don't. I don't. Fine. We'll look at this stupid thing that instead. Is so cool that my signature actually counted. Go, Miss Grant. Uh, dear Miss Grant, as principal of Blackwell Academy, it, it is my glad, ha glad, happy, fortunate duty to inform me that your petition to block the installation of a new surveillance system has received enough signatures for the school to reject the plan. It is not my policy to take sides in these matters, as we encourage faculty and student body to participate in the school's operation. However, I, I do recognize the controversial nature of these cameras and shared your concern for the possible invasion of the privacy. Thank you for your passion and inspiring Blackwell students to make their voices heard. I hope they will feel empowered by the outcome of your petition. Best, Principal Wells. See, it'd be cool if you could have security cameras, but if there was a way for them to only be looked at if something, like, um, something bad happened. Like, you know, if a student went to, like, the principal and said, hey, I just got stabbed by this person, and then that was the only time. You know, so you know what I'm saying? But I don't even know how. Shocker. Uh, Sean Prescott, Principal Wells, in light of the recent outrageous allegations against my son and his suspension, I feel that my large contribution to Blackwell Academy should be also suspended. Of course, the situation can be rectified once Nathan is reinstated to Blackwell with a written apology. Along with that, I understand that the tragic event involving Miss Marsh gives you pause, but I would suggest canceling Thursday's party is not conductive to the can-do spirit of Blackwell Academy. I expect you to reconsider and come to the same obvious conclusion. Thank you, Sean Prescott. Screw you! Butthole eel. By the way, I, I just want to point this out. So Nathan Prescott. Why do people do this? Bully too. Shocker. Like the the dash, the da Like you know when when a, a word doesn't fit on a line. I see this in books sometimes too. Why not just have the word on the next line? I never understood why some writers do that. Because it looks way better than having a word cut in half, right? I really want to click on that bronze hawk, but it's not letting me. I want to take your picture, bronze hawk. Long Next, talk. <laughs> come check out these files. Dear Nathan principal, something. Rachel of bringing drugs on campus, and my step troll went along because he thinks Rachel was a bad influence on me. Wow. Assholes. If David is teaming up with Nathan Prescott, that's a bad sign. Hey, up, Nathan up. Prescott the third. Ooh, he's so money. And you know <laughs> the Prescotts dropped major bank to bury Nathan's real file. Look, it reads like a rap sheet. Bad grades, teacher complaints, secret probation. But I was expelled. At least Nathan was finally suspended. Check out that note. Take pictures, okay. Max. Take all the pictures. It's just some crazy drawing. It's not a drawing. Look. Rachel in the dark room. Rachel in the dark room. What? Over I don't know what this means. That's it. That's fucked up. What does this even mean? Nathan is truly psychotic. What the hell is going on? He has something to do with Rachel missing. Whoa. Listen to this. David M. always asks what's going on in my head. David M. always helps me follow those he follows. What the hell? It's pretty cryptic. No, it sounds like they formed some sort of weird team, the Super He Bros. <laughs> Jesus. David was stalking Kate, hassling me, and now we know he was all over Rachel, too. I don't oh, think... We are so uh... going into his garage files. Plus, I'm getting a little paranoid in here. We got our info. Let's bail. But maybe we shouldn't leave without a gift. No, you are not taking the cozy chair. Does <laughs> include mind reading? Uh, I thought she's gonna take that. Rewind talk. because I tried to steal the chair. Shit, I'm confused. It's the powers of best friendship. I know. How the hell did you even take that chair? That'd be we very difficult. Definitely get out of here. We pressed our luck enough. Hello, what have we here? Holy that shit! From? Jackpot! Don't steal, you Jack idiot! Wow, sir. That's a lot for the handicapped fund. Dude, there's $5,000 here. I could pay Frank back tonight. This will chill him out after our knife showdown yesterday. Oh, man. I'm going to have to choose between her stealing it. 
Are you gonna make a big issue out of this? Or just be willing <sighs> to take the greenbacks for yourself? I hope you do that instead of lecturing me. Have we left any other evidence? I mean, we're stealing files. So we've already kind of, you know... Yeah. There's no security cameras. It's kind of bad I'm thinking about stealing the money. I think I'm going to steal the money. Gets Frank off her back. And we've already stolen stuff, so it's like, you know... If we get busted... We can't really get in more shit for stealing money. But I mean, it's a freaking... Is it a handicap fund, or is that just... Steal a damn money. Just do it. Just do it. Frank knows things about Rachel, and he might talk if he's been paid. Right? You are Supermax. That was a bad idea. And with the leftover dough, I'll take you on a road trip to Portland for the day. We'll stock up on tats, beer, weed, and donuts, and books from Powell's, and strip clubs. <laughs> Kidding. But you never know. Uh, I'm gonna regret all the things. Can I cha move the? I feel like shit for taking that money. Uh, I know, I know. Can we see? Oh my God, that is. Ah, uh, dear Mr. and Mrs. Prescott, let's just actually read this. We regret to inform you that Aether Prescott has dis uh, disrupted various classes over the past month, despite repeated warnings and leniency, due to a crude outburst at Mrs. Mrs. Hoida's intro to literature class on Tuesday, September 17th, Nathan was sent back to his dormitory for the day without a proper write-up for his files. Nathan has enormous potential, but his erratic behavior patterns that may need supervision beyond Blackwell's ability. The school cannot tolerate these disruptions, so we hope you, we will discuss this matter with Nathan to impress upon him the severity of his situation. Please see attached files for the full report. Update expunged record. Dear... Principal Wells, we received rather outrageous and possible slanderous letter from somebody in an administration accused of negative, uncharacteristic, erratic behavior patterns. We're certain this must be a mistake, otherwise we fear that we will take Nathan out of Blackwell to a more prestigious and better funded institution. Please respond with a copy of the ex expunged dis disciplinary blah, blah blah record letter. I don't want to see that. Oh my god. That is... Following this reported incidents involving Nathan Prescott, there seemed to be a pattern of outbursts and confrontations following remorse and repentance. We suggest his parents remove him from the school and place him under expert psychological supervision, throwing a desk in class, cursing at his English teacher, lighting fireworks in the bathroom, stealing school supplies, threatening the school custodian, attempted theft of campus to buy a statue. <laughs> well, well, this is actually kind of creepy. He's a very disturbed lad. David Madsen and Nathan Prescott have both come to my office to warn me that Rachel Amber has been a drug mule in Mr. Madsen's talk radio terminology, act, acting as front as for another local dealer. Considering Rachel's ex, ex, exemplary status, I told David that I would need more concrete proof, and he promised that he had more to show. I was surprised to get unscheduled visit from Rachel Amber. She seemed quite upset and claimed that David Madsen was following her taking photographs. For, yeah. Um... Yeah, David would deny this, and given the questionable company Rachel has been keeping, I'm not quite certain I can believe her now. I want to see that. I guess we can't see that picture. Oh, I just clicked that dang window. Dang, dang it. God dang it. All right, Braun Talk. Time's up. It's time. Time. What the balls? So let me take a picture, Braun Talk. That's all I want. I can't, I can't like, it, it's, oops, it's constantly like, when I go to like, look, the freaking hawk's in the center of my screen, but I can't get it off the computer screen to get it on the hawk. I can only like view it from this side for some reason. God damn it, why is this so freaking, god damn it, how do I, how does one, how do I take a picture of bronze hawk? I thought maybe once Rachel, what I mean, uh, once Chloe left, I'd be able to do this easier, but no. No. All right, let's get the heck out of here, I guess. It's so frustrating. It's right here. I know I need a picture of it. And I know I should get it from this side, but I can't click it. I can't. Ah, oh, so frustrating. I gotta push this chair. 
push any freaking all their chairs. God damn, it's gonna be stupid. Let's go. Let's go and immediately regret all the things. Fine. Whatever. That impish look scares me. Care What'd you for do? a midnight swim? The Blackwell pool is ours. Swimming? You wanna take that risk now? It's been a cray week. We deserve a little mindless fun in the water. We're done for the night anyway. We're rich <sighs> and nobody busted us. So? Splish splash? You're right. We hella deserve Really? That was gonna get another splish option splash. there. Did splish you splash. actually <laughs> just say hella? I think I'm a good bad influence on you. Oh no. And before more sexual tension. Oh, okay. Oh, I was gonna say, did, did we just skip that part? I was gonna say, that'd be weird for them to make a big deal out of it than just not have a scene with that involved. Whoa, those magic opening doors. We're in just the touch them, like, spoil it up. Big fucking deal. I want that heated water. We still have to play it cool, okay? I still go to school here. You can own this hellhole once you figure out your rewind power. <laughs> That's not true. Chloe is so Very psyched limited. for girls' night out, so I better follow her. I would love a soda, but I just get wired. Oh, that said weird. I was like, what? Why would you get weird go from otters. soda? Go otters, go otters, go. So what's the difference between the otters and the 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 the, the, the Bigfoots? Wait. I'm confused. I thought maybe this was the, uh, is this just... Is, is the honors like I guess that's probably similar. I actually similarly. don't have the time to invest. Lost in goggles. <laughs> I admit I am. I can't read that. Just click read. I admit I'm a goofball and misplaced the flexi wave swim goggles I found. Eternal gratitude. A twenty-five dollar bean hip ca cafe gift card. Contact Ray Siren or Siren at Blackwell Academy. Blah blah blah. Wow, that's really dumb. <laughs> if only I could solve the mystery of the missing cat pics. That is for stolen backpack, school books, and a new tablet. I need this for class, and my tablet has private pics of my late cat's rip, so I need pay pay a cash or no questions asked. If you have any details or would like to return my backpack, I have my contact info now, please. I stole it. <laughs> I hope the otters will survive. The earth can't wait. Inform yourself and share. Become an equal volunteer today. Ooh, I love being an equal volunteer. Hello, Chloe. I can't click on you, so we're going to go inside now. <laughs> Wait, is that... What do I do? Alright, great swim. Let's go now. Oh, there you go. Boys or girls? Ooh. Yeah, screw it. Let's go to the boys, boys of course. Why Figures. not? Perv. Let me check to see if the pool's heated. Uh, I feel like something very bad is going to happen. Everything's been going too smooth. And that was an ominous boom noise going on. Old jackets. I guess somebody forgot their Blackwell spirit. LOL. I guess I should consider this evolution. Dana, I know I'm an a-hole, but I still care about you, love Logan. <laughs> Wait, what was it? I thought it's like... Oh, Logan. I thought it's a lifeguard's locker. I was going to say, that's weird. Sometimes. Or is it's all bad. Where did, uh... I thought, um... I thought Chloe was over here. Chloe's a very unfitting name for her, by the way. I put that, but I guess that's kind of the point. Nathan's locker, a. Eh? It's okay for Nathan to be hooked. Holy on crap! Drugs, right. Good God! I feel like we should take these all these drugs just just to mess with them even more. Some poor hipster lost their vape. Oh no! <laughs> oh, that's awesome. I thought I that was like a knife. I that in Jefferson's class. <sighs> but why? Is this Warren? His locker. Yeah, it's Warren. I mean, why? Cell phone. Zach Ooh. is really careless. Doesn't he know what happens when I'm around? Trey Chase, hey, thinking about bad things about you. Wow. Cool, what are you wearing? Just my crystal necklace and phone. Hot. What are you wearing? I'm in a locker room. I'm wearing a jersey sitting on my football. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> no way am I touching Zach's oh, jersey. That's hilarious. This Floats. must be for training kids. No, they're for me. I can't swim. Hello. That's so dumb. Zach that is same really okay. Careless. Say it said look and then cell phone. The they look different, you know. Graffiti. But there's a thing on that umbrella. Umbrella. What the hell? Um, 
umbrella? Why an umbrella on my head for? Water be water water belly? What is that? What is happening with my mind right now? Water bottle. Locker room is right. Sets me up. Huh, it's nice Victoria to know loves Victoria the yeah. loves something besides herself. Oh, well, it's a very crudely drawn penis. Ma Max is a feminazi. Welcome to 1950. I love Warren Grimm. Grimm. I bet you do. Gayram. Oh, Gayram, I got you. Why, there's so much graffiti in the school. It's It's stupid, man. <laughs> Dana Hido a baby daddy. I like that me gusto face. Very nice, very nice. This one is almost empty. The guys must like their paint goo. Oh, I see. Max Caulfield, moral avenger. Or self righteous hypocrite. What's that one say? Six nine reasons to bang bros Rachel. Will be bros. Take a look. We got no running in the pool. Pool toy. Just a shark. I thought it was safe to go back in the water. Ah! <laughs> no running, no diving. I hate that lost swimming pools have a no diving rule. It's like that's kind of one of the fun things about going to the pool, you know. Uh, got anything else? Well, let me explore for a reason. There's got to be something. What's this? Looks like I'm the Vortex Club bouncer. Decisions, decisions. Ooh, who could we oh, remove? I'm sorry. Your names are not on the list. You'll have to eat shit now. I wonder whose names are removed. I feared there'd be something. I wonder whose names you like crossed I'm off. Looks like I'm the Vortex Club bouncer. Decisions, decisions. I wish you at least told me whose names are removed. Hopefully it's not someone I like, but I, I doubt that would be a thing. What if it's someone that I'm just kind of neutral with, like, um, uh, what's her name? Victoria's friend. I don't remember. Ooh. I don't remember her name off the top of my head now. My head's exploding. No running, no diving. Screw it all. Ha 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 ha. Is there anything secret here? No, I just ran this corner for nothing. Wonderful. What about this corner? Nothing. Weird. I've never seen these crates before. Like, ever. And, like, I'm not talking about this game, but in, like, real life. Alright. Oh, okay. That's the locker room. What's this? The lifeguard. Oh, because you can't run out of air. I know where to come. <laughs> Search. Yes, we get it. Otters. Plug holes. Academy 2012. Otter power. Blah 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 blah. blah, 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 blah. You don't even think I'm gonna make a move on you. <laughs> wow. Now I have to go do that. Light and. Uh, I don't know if I want to do that or not. We'll go talk to Chloe first. See so, if she wants me to turn plan on. plan is win. <laughs> wow, that's cheesy. Any messages? Nope. Oh, ah! Look spoopy! At the Halloween pumpkin. Spoopy! Spoopy! Anything else? No, okay. Alright. So. Ooh. Coffee and swimming. Good combo. So sarcasm. What do you think, Chloe? You really got any episode just here. Couldn't wait to splish splash in the pool. <laughs> That's adorable. Splish splash. Uh, thanks everyone for watching. If you enjoyed, the best way to support me is by leaving us a, a, a like and subscribe to my channel already. I'm going back, so I really wanted to see. Yeah, look at that, Key Master Chloe. Oh, that's adorable. <laughs> hmm. Okay. Uh, time to read the rest of this and call it an episode. Uh, something bigger than any of us, but we kind of suck at being master spies since we didn't have the key for principal. Oh, officer. No reason. Ever. Okay, I already read all this. So grateful he's on my team. Talk about being in the Sancto Santor Ten Santorum. Thanks a lot in class. I barely passed. I don't know what that means. A uh, Blackwell. I did feel freaking weird about being in the principal's office after midnight, going through his files and laptop with Chloe. She was way too into it. Technically, we could. What if we were? What if someone saw us do that? What if someone was like looking in the window? We did have a light on. Ooh, that's scary. Or what if Principal Wells has a secret security camera in his office? No. He could be arrested and thrown in jail. Yikes. But then again, I guess even if we didn't steal the money. Like, once again, we were in there, so we stole stuff. 
Yikes, I just pretended that we were on a very special episode of Wizards of Waverly Place. You know, just a couple of wacky Sherlock's investigating the school for a good cause. Yeah, that helped. Well, we didn't find the proof. We found Nathan's file had a weird drawing that just said Rachel in the dark room over and over. So that's a major clue that Nathan is involved in this somehow. I thought it was the same major clue that Nathan is a crazy guy. Or he's just insane. Oh, there we go. <laughs> but he also know, has no also referenced David M, which means that we absolutely have to find a way into David's secret bunker files for good cause. But Chloe just can't help herself, and she actually took five grand in cash marked handicap fund, because that's got to be legit, am I right? <laughs> I, yeah, it's probably bullshit to be honest. I can't think of a faster route to Karma Hell. It would be clear Chloe's debt to Frank. I'll find a way to make up to the fun. After all, saving a life is priority, as as is my habit with Chloe. No matter what, our fates seem to be bound for better or for worse. Usually for worse. Yup, yup. Yup, yup. Anything else? Alright. No, looks like we're about halfway through this episode. Uh, thank you everyone once again for watching. Uh, if you enjoyed, the best way to support me is definitely by uh, leaving a like and subscribing to my channel if you haven't already. If there's any games you want to recommend me to play, uh, check out the top link in my description. It'll easy to a video that's meant specifically for that. I will talk to you guys later. Bye!